Hey, 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 what is up? It is your boy, Will. Welcome back to the Skinny Survivor channel. I'm super excited. Today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you five simple and easy to prepare carb sources that are gonna help you bulk up and gain weight faster this month. So if you're new to this channel, I help skinny guys gain their first 30 pounds of muscle so they can be confident buff guys and dominate life. So if you're new to this channel, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of my upcoming content to help you gain more weight. So without further ado, let's get into this video. All right, so to start this video, I simply want to outline why it's so important to have a good amount of great carb sources in your diet as a skinny guy. So as a skinny guy, as an ectomorph or a hard gainer, you've probably heard all these terms. You know, we have a very, very fast metabolism. So that simply means that we burn through our food very, very quickly. So when it comes to carbs, if we're not consuming enough carbohydrates, we're simply gonna burn out of carbohydrates. We're gonna feel tired, we're gonna feel lethargic, and we're not gonna have the motivation to train. So if you've ever felt like, oh man, I just, I just don't wanna train. I literally have no motivation, I'm so tired, you know, and you just don't have that fire to train, it's probably because you're not consuming enough carbs. So I want to also explain what carbs actually are. They are your most used and readily used energy source in your body. So that's why it's so important to have a good amount of carbs in your diet and to make sure you're consuming enough carbs every single day. Now having an optimal amount of carbohydrates is going to allow you to be more motivated during the day, have more energy during the day, simply work out better, push more weight out in the gym and perform at your best. And this is gonna allow you to gain more weight, gain more muscle, and make sure you're maximizing your potential as a skinny guy. Not only this, but I've noticed as a skinny guy, actually consuming a good amount of carbs is actually gonna make you look better. Let me explain. So carbs actually hold water. So if you're having enough carbs, you're gonna hold a lot of water in your muscles and your muscles are gonna look bigger and fuller. Now, when you're really low on carbs, you're gonna look simply flat and every time you train, after you train, you're just gonna flatten out and you're gonna look small. So you're gonna have a good amount of carbs in your body, in your diet to make sure you look full and look big. So if you wanna get big, make sure you have a good amount of carbs to fuel your performance, fuel your workouts, but also to look better. All right, so now you know why carbs are so important to include in your diet as a skinny guy. I'm gonna introduce to you five simple carb sources that you can add to your diet to start getting more results, fueling your workouts better, having more energy, more motivation, and start gaining more lean muscle this month. <music> All right, so let's quickly get into our first carb source. Let me get it right now. So our first carb source is rice. Now you can have brown rice, you can have white rice. It doesn't really matter. There are some benefits of having brown rice like increased fiber intake, increased vitamins and minerals that you simply don't get from white rice. But from a perspective of performance as a skinny guy, they're both good. They both have their benefits. Now, I would recommend white rice if you simply have less of an appetite and you want something that's more easy to go down. But I like, I really like brown rice as well. I have brown rice pretty much like every single day. Now, the reason I like rice is because you can prepare a good solid amount of rice in the morning, you know, and you just want to cook one whole batch of rice and then you can split that into portions during the day. So let's say for example, I have two cups of rice and I put it in my rice cooker. I can literally cook that two cups of rice and split it during the day so I don't have to cook anything else and it's gonna fuel me through the day. It's gonna give me a great carb source to have during the day. Now, another reason why I like rice as a carb source is because of how many carbs you get with just one serving. So with 100 grams of raw rice, you're gonna get 80 carbs. Now, I don't know about you, but I struggle to get into my carb intake during the day. I struggle with getting more food in, and this is one of the biggest struggles of skinny guys. They simply can't get in enough food, and that's why they don't gain weight. Maybe that's why you don't gain weight. Well, if you're having rice, it's an easy way to get down more food, more calories, and more carbs with just one serving. So you're gonna get, again, 80 carbs per 100 grams 
of raw white rice. Now, from a health standpoint, it's extremely high in fiber. It's extremely high in vitamins and minerals. I'm not gonna go through all those vitamins and minerals because there are a lot of them, but it's really good for you in general in terms of maintaining a great well being, maintaining great health. <laughs> All right, so second simple carb sauce to include in your diet as a skinny guy to help you bulk up faster is potatoes. So why do I like potatoes? I like potatoes because you can prepare them in a diversity of ways. You can bake them, you can grill them, you can boil them. There's so many ways to prepare potatoes and they're super easy to prepare as well. Now, I also like them because they're a great carb source. You know, they pack a huge amount of carbs in what you're getting. So in 100 grams of potatoes or raw potatoes weighed out, you're gonna get around 17 carbs per 100 grams. So I've tested this myself. When it comes to potato, I usually have anywhere between 300 to 400 grams of raw potato when I weigh it. And that comes to about 60 to 70 carbs. So if you have around that for one serving, you're gonna get 60 to 70 extra carbs in your day. So again, this is a huge amount of carbs that you can add to your diet. So an easy example of how you can prepare potatoes is simply slice them in halves, put them in the oven for 30 to 40 minutes, let them go golden, and then put some salt on it. And that's an easy way to prepare your potatoes as a carb sauce that you can have during the day. All right, so simple carb sauce number three is pasta. Now, why do I like pasta? Again, it's super easy to prepare. I'm gonna pretty much prepare it for lunch and I'm just gonna put literally tuna and some tomato paste and then I've got an easy meal to bulk up and gain more weight. Now, I'm gonna show you that in the upcoming videos over the upcoming weeks. Very, very simple way to prepare pasta so you have a good carb and a protein source to bulk up faster. But for now, I just wanna explain why pasta is so good to include in your diet. So with 100 grams of raw pasta, you're gonna get around 70 carbs. So again, very, very good in terms of the carb content. If you're a skinny guy and you wanna bump up those carbs, pasta is definitely something you want to add in your diet. Now, when it comes to pasta, I actually recommend you go with a whole wheat pasta because it contains more fiber. It's gonna sustain you longer in terms of energy and it's just better for your body. So try to find a whole wheat pasta in the grocery store to make sure that you've got a good carb source and it's good for your body. All right, so carb source number four is sweet potato. So these ones are actually from Australia where I was originally from. And these are the same sweet potatoes that I took and ate every day to prepare for my competition as a fitness model. But also these sweet potatoes, I included them in my diet pretty much every single day to make sure my diet was on point and that I got enough carbs in my diet. So why do I recommend sweet potatoes? Again, they're a great carb source. For every 100 grams of raw sweet potato, you're gonna get around 20 carbohydrates. So in a good serving, if you're having anywhere between 300 grams to 400 grams of raw sweet potato, when you weigh it, you're gonna get around 80 carbs. So 70, 80 carbs. Again, very good for boosting your carbohydrate intake. And one of the biggest things I've noticed eating sweet potato over my training experience and over my years is it's a perfect source for fueling you in terms of energy over a long period of time. So what you'll find when you first start training as a beginner is there's so many carb sources that you could have in your diet. So when you first start training as a skinny guy, you're gonna find that there are tons of carb sources that you could choose to include in your diet. Now, I recommend sweet potato because it's a complex carbohydrate. And what that simply means is it takes longer to digest than normal carbohydrates. And that means it's gonna sustain you with more energy over a longer period of time. Now, a big mistake that most skinny guys make is in the beginning, they go with a lot of simple carbohydrates. Now, these carbohydrates are things like junk food, lollies, things like potato chips. These are horrible carbohydrates because they're not gonna sustain you over a long period of time. This is gonna be a great source of energy to fuel your workouts and make sure you have energy during your day. All right, so the last carb source to include in your diet to make sure you bulk up efficiently, you have more energy during your day is whole wheat 
bread. Now, the reason why you wanna choose whole wheat bread is because it contains more fiber and it's simply better for your body. And it's also gonna provide you with a more sustained amount of energy during the day. Instead of white bread, which is only gonna fuel you for the first maybe 30 minutes to an hour. So in just two slices of bread, you're gonna get around 25 carbs. So again, it's a great carb source and it's also very easy to eat if you don't have much of an appetite. You can just have one, two slices of bread anytime during the day and that way you can boost your carbs and hit your carb intake every single day. So if you're not a big eater, bread is a good option for you as a carb source because you can pick how much you want. You can have one slice, two slices, even three slices if you're hungry. And also if you're not big on taste, you can also use a variety of spreads to make it taste better. So you can get in your calories, get in your carbs and fuel your workouts better. So let me share with you one easy trick you can do with bread to get a huge boost of calories and carbohydrates. Just take two, three slices of bread, toast it, get one whole avocado, slice the avocado up and spread that on top. That's gonna to be a great way to boost your calorie intake during the day and also boost your carb intake so you perform better and train better in the gym and build more muscle. All right, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Hope you got tons and tons of value. Learn why carbs are so important to include in your diet to gain weight and bulk up faster. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss any of my upcoming content. And I also wanna give you a free gift today. So if you're still struggling, you don't know what to eat, maybe you don't know which carb source to have, I wanna give you my mass gain grocery list. And all you need to do is click somewhere on this page and I'll also put it in the description. So this grocery list is gonna help you bulk up and know exactly what to eat so you can gain up to 10 pounds in the next 30 days. So that's it from me for today. I will see you in the next video, peace.